Zeke is gone, Schultz is gone, but the thirst for a championship has never left Dallas. In this draft, I will try to position the Cowboys in the driver's seat to take on the AFC champion next year. Is Dak Prescott good enough to lead the Dallas Cowboys to the Super Bowl? I don't know, but I do know that he's been protected throughout his career by a decent offensive line, plus the defenses Dallas faced always had to account for the run game with Zeke and Pollard pounding the rock. CD Lamb, Gallup and Schultz were Dak's pass catchers and they were better than average. Helping Prescott out with more playmakers couldn't hurt, but ultimately he's got to show that he's still the guy from the 2019 and 2021 season. The pass rush of the Cowboys is legit, with Parsons, Lawrence and Sam Williams collapsing pockets and leading the way. The run defense could use some help, and that's an understatement. The secondary has some playmakers, and that unit hasn't got any weaker with the addition of Stefan Gilmore. Whatever scenario will play out, the front office should focus on an interior defensive lineman who can stop the run. I hope that Kansi or Breezy are still available, but in this draft that won't be the case. So I will settle for Mazzy Smith. He flexed his muscles at the combine with 34 bench reps, which was the most of any player in attendance and confirmed what everybody already knew. Mazzy Smith is special. He blends phenomenal size and power with athleticism and quickness. And when his hands get a hold inside the opponent's shoulder pads, it's game over. He's the pocket pusher and nose tackle that the Cowboys need in defending the run. The Cowboys could draft a running back, but my attention goes to the rapidly aging offensive line. And in my mock draft, the player that I target is still available. With this pick I select Matthew Bergeron. Bergeron has played both sides of the line in his career and has all the skills to be a tackle in the NFL. You can even move him to the guard position. He's a terrific pass protector, a quick processor and has a lot of experience under his belt while competing against some excellent ACC edge rushers. Under the tutelage of Zach Martin and Tyron Smith, he can develop into the franchise tackle that every team wants and needs. With the next pick, I will turn the weakest position group of the Cowboys into one of the better ones. Moro Ojomo is a 6 feet 3 defensive tackle who had his most productive year in 2022 while playing for the Longhorns. His long arms, 34.5 inches, in combination with strong hands firing into pads snap after snap makes him a force to be reckoned with. Ojomo is an excellent run defender and could be much more if he develops his pass rush move to the next level in Dallas. Did I address the interior of the defensive line too much? I would like to see you in the comment section where we can discuss what you would do in this upcoming draft. And subscribe if you want to see more.